So you guys, I met Kate from Brightex, and she's letting me try out one of the strollers. And this is a new uh, stroller that Brightex has come out with. And I am really impressed because it's got some features that my other one, who shall remain nameless, great girl, doesn't have. And uh, I'm really enjoying it. And one of the cool things about this particular model is you know how when you're using a stroller and you always have your keys and your cell phone and all that stuff? This has a compartment to actually put it in and you can shut it. So if you're raining or you're running through something, you don't get your phone rained on. It's got two drink compartments. And the thing that I think is really great is I love the designs. There's all different kind of designs and you kind of want to be cute. But the reason I chose this design is because Lucy spills stuff and it doesn't really show up because it all looks part of the, uh, the cow pattern. Now I'm not a professional reviewer, I'm a mom. So I'm just gonna be honest with you. I really, really like this stroller. I like it because for some reason the wheels are engineered to go very smooth. I've used this in airports. It's lightweight, so it's kind of become my all-in-one purpose stroller. It's got this thing that Lucy likes. It's a window, so when I'm out with her and I do this thing like, hey, you still in there? And for some reason, because I think of the cow print and it's fun, she likes to get in the stroller. I was actually starting to get her be antsy when she turned two. She didn't want to be in the stroller. She's like, I get out, I get out. And then we had to put her through the conveyor belt at the airport and then you get in trouble and you're getting sued. So this is actually a fun stroller for her to be in. And she actually likes to be in the stroller. She will climb in the stroller before we leave. And so it's different than some of the other ones. It's um. It's got this thing where it goes out, excuse me, like I said. So you can just take that off and it slides right back on. And uh, it's pretty easy. I like that it's not complicated with the straps. They just snap right in. I had another stroller. If you just really want to compare, the one that I bought was a Graco um, model and you had to snap in three different things. And I like this one because it's one. It's just like right there and you're done. You don't have to snap up here, you don't have to snap down here. It's really nice, it's been really durable. And the last thing I wanna show you is it's got really nice storage. So you can get your diaper bag, you can get everything in here. And it's been really an awesome stroller. I've really enjoyed it and I, I just, I love it. And I think that I'm gonna get one for Ron. So thank you, Brian Tux. So you guys, next week, we're gonna have another guest. I'm sort of on this Hollywood kick lately, but let me tell you what's gonna be going on for the next couple weeks. Next week, I've got a celebrity Hollywood photographer who I met at the Boom Boom Room from the Golden Globe. She's going to come and uh, we're going to do an interview and she's going to talk to me about some of her experiences doing shoots, Hollywood premieres, red carpets, but also she specializes in doing moms and babies and family shoots. So she's going to give some tips on doing family photography. And uh, later in the month, she's actually going to shoot some pictures for Bride Tech strollers. And uh, Lucy, my daughter, is going to get to be a part of that. And I think Ron and I are are two and then the week after that on march 22nd tuesday zena del schroeder is a friend of mine who is a hollywood filmmaker and she decided to move to montana and get this become a cattle farmer she's a filmmaker who actually got her movie made and produced and she's a cattle farmer and she's bringing some of her cattle meat to california and she's going to teach me how to prepare cattle which i think is meat I'm not totally sure, but that is really exciting. And I've got some other really exciting guests coming up. So thanks for watching Laugh Break. I hope you had fun. Shaleen is awesome. She's not a real blonde. Don't tell her I said that, um, but she has great hair. So you guys, thanks for watching the show. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.